clinical integration. When a patient call comes through, Surgery Connect will contact your clinical database to see if you have any patients matching the inbound calling number. If it does, when you answer a call, you will be asked if you want to move over into that patient's record in your clinical database. If the system finds more than one patient, it will bring up a pop-up on your screen that looks like this. It's normally in the bottom right hand corner of the screen and will show the inbound calling number that Surgery Connect has checked against the clinical database. We also know that this number dialed in last nine days ago and when they spoke to somebody, spoke to Dr. Stephen. When you answer the call, it could either be George or Lucille, as both of these patients have this contact number on their clinical record. So when you answer the call, you'll need to work out which patient we need to speak about. You then have their date of birth so that you can do a DPA check. And when you're happy, just click on the patient name within the pop-up and that will take you straight into the clinical database, loading up that patient's details straight away for you. When calling patients, if you're in the practice with the integration software running in the background, you can call a patient directly from the clinical record. With the patient active on the screen in front of you, you can use your keyboard to make the call by pressing Ctrl, Shift and H to dial their home number or Ctrl, Shift and N to dial the patient's mobile number. This works like click to call, so we'll call your desk phone. When you answer your desk phone, it will then connect you to the patient's number on whichever number you've requested. Alternatively, at the bottom of the screen will be an orange circle in your taskbar, usually next to your browser. Whilst in the clinical database with the patient active, if you click on the orange circle, it will then bring up a pop-up that will confirm the current patient that you're viewing. You will have different tabs, but on the contact tab, you'll have the patient numbers. You can now either dial that number manually or use the click to call technology by clicking on the call button on the screen to connect with your desk phone and then call the patient once you've answered that device. At the end of the call, you may also get a pop-up that will ask you if you want to associate that call to the patient's record. Clicking on yes, We'll put a timestamp onto the clinical database saying that there has been a call on this date and time and the call recording will then be saved in the call log on the integration software. 